Today I want to show you how to loosen up the piriformis muscle. Most people will show you on foam rollers or balls with the hip in a stretch position. This can be very painful. I want to show you today how to do it without the piriformis being stretched, but you can still get in nice and deep going through the gluteus maximus. So you need a mat, you want to place the farewell on the mat, and you're going to lie on your back with your knees bent. You're going to raise your hips up off the floor and place the fair wheel right between the sacrum and the greater trochanter here, the outer hip. And then you're just going to let your leg drop. My other hand is supporting my hip here. It's underneath my butt, so I'm not uh, unlevel. And then I'm just going to let that fair wheel sink right into deep in the piriformis. Then what I can do is I can rotate my leg back and forth. The piriformis is not on a stretch here, so it's not as painful, but you're still getting in on the fibers nice and deep. You can place the edge of the farewell right on the uh, edge of the sacrum, which gets real close to the uh, insertion, and nice and easy. And then I can move different positions. I can take the farewell and move it out a little farther towards the uh, hip here. Same thing, rotating my hip back and forth. And again, you can feel it. You can feel it being mobilized or moved, but it's not excruciating painful like some of the rollers or the balls, and it shouldn't be. Then we can take the farewell, move in a different position, 90 degrees, drop the hip, rotate, nice and easy. And again, different angles, different positions. And you'll feel that hot spot and you're just trying to mobilize that muscle nice and easy. So this is a great way to mobilize the piriformis muscle without excruciating pain.